Hello and welcome to another episode of Redstone Ready Super Flat Survival and the sun is setting but we finally got another tree so I need to quickly quickly hurry up and just um, chop down the tree before the monsters start spawning and they will start spawning very soon and looks like I'm already almost almost done let me just get one sapling for this yep I got no, no, let's, let's shoot for more, let's shoot, yep. And we already see the moon coming up. Let's see, no difficulties, not normal. And dang, am I getting a lot of sapling for this. I don't think I'm gonna get any more, and the last ray of sunshine has set. And then we're almost gonna be done, almost, almost, come on, come on. Until the mobs start spawning, there's already spawns, there's already spawns. And yes, guys, and look at all these skeletons spawning out there. And there's some creepers also. Let's see. Yep, 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 yep. I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm, I'm actually... I don't... I don't like just sitting and waiting. So what I'm going to do is I am actually going to kill some zombies. Because I just want to kill some. Yep, there we go. Now we can actually eat. What I'm going to do right now is I'm going to take my crafting table with me right now just, let me just destroy that over here. and oh my god oh my god ouch ouch get the get out of here so yeah now the good thing with this is now we can finally get some food to eat let's see let me just just make some planks right now just um Shift click that, make all the sticks, and yeah, just instantly turn it all into sticks because I just um I need sticks the most. Let me just let me just make a pickaxe just so I can mine mine the dirt we collect. I mean I mean mine the sandstone so I can get in and out of here. Maybe I should have made a door. I'm not sure. I don't know, guys. This is just all so weird, guys. Maybe we can get up just enough to regen. No, let's see. We got some uh, Endermen out there. Don't want to touch those creepers back there. And, and dang, this feels like easy mode. Like, like, what is this? Let me just set it to hard. Yeah, I'm a hardcore player. Sorry, guys. I'm going to set it to hard. I don't like it when it's all like empty like this. We need more mobs. Until the skeletons just start just shooting at us. We're just gonna have to attract some mobs. We're gonna attract some of these zombies here. We can just kill them for flesh. And yeah, that's pretty efficient. Oh, he didn't give us any flesh. Oh, and he didn't give us any flesh either. So that's maybe because I said it's a hard. I don't know. Does hard actually... Does hard actually reduce the drops? I don't know, and oh dang. Oh my god. I hate these. Good thing they drop flesh as well. It's funny, they drop the same amount of flesh as their parents do. <laughs> the small zombies. Alright guys, it's much more fun than I thought. I, was, I thought I was just gonna have to sit and wait, and maybe we should kill some um, spiders to get a bed so we can get string. But then we're gonna have to kill a ton of spiders. Come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. All right, we got two spiders on us. Oh, 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 we got we got villagers. Oh, there's a zombie villager. Oh, oh, we got we got four villagers on us. We got oh, 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 there's one with a an ouch, ouch, ouch. All right, let's. All right, all right, all right, all right. All right, I hope he drops the. Yeah, that was epic. Yay, we got some string. Let's eat some more flesh. I would usually just hide inside, but since I'm not doing a let's play, it'd be more interesting to walk around. See, don't want to touch those creepers over there. There's quite a bit over there. Wait, is that, um... Yep, there's an Enderman. Dang, there's a lot of zombie villagers spawning. Maybe we will even need them. Oh my god. Oh my god, there's a creeper. Alright, alright. Alright, 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 alright. Alright, alright. Alright, alright. All right, all right. Anybody behind us? Nope. No. Oh, there's one in golden armor. Oh, oh, there's there's a skeleton in golden armor. Maybe we should go get that. Just eat some more flesh. Flesh is actually a pretty effective source of food. Let's see. 
Oh, we got some XP flowing on there, but we don't need that. We're already gonna have an XP farm. Uh, maybe. Oh, oh, I need, I need, I need strength for a bow. I need strength. I need, I need strength for a bow. Ouch. That hurt. I we're gonna regen. I'm so glad I didn't actually die. That was a close call. I really shouldn't do stuff like that with um with a sword like that since it's just patch that up right over here. And we got more villagers on us. We got more zombie villagers on us and we got more zombie villagers on us. Let me think, maybe I should um I really wanna get this uh, zombie villager down into this ditch right here. Ouch, 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 ouch. Oh my god. Oh my god. Let me just yeah, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna yeah. Oh 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 sh oh my god oh my god oh my god oh my god Alright guys I'm not going back out there. I am not going back out there until I fully regen guys. Yeah, that was pretty fun. We almost died back there. Problem is, I can't see anything. So, yeah, unfortunately, I will probably have to cut filming here because, well, I'm not going to be going outside anytime soon until it turns to daylight and I can hear that skeleton burn. So, see you guys in a while. So, welcome back, guys. And it hasn't been morning yet, but I don't want to just sit here and do nothing. So, what I thought I'm going to do is I'm just going to plop my crafting table down here. I'm going to craft some sandstone slabs, just enough to cover this bottom portion like this. And what I want to do is I'm going to... I'm actually going to... Yes. And, wow, it's already morning. I thought they were going to fall in here. I actually, I really thought it was still, I, I really thought it was still, alright, kill that, I, I actually really thought it was still nighttime, but apparently they're burning up already, which is really, really nice, let's see, of course there's gonna be all these skeletons, there's gonna be spiders and skeletons left over, and we got some flesh, See all this group of spiders down here? Let's see how they... Let's see. Come, come. Even though they become, like, passive, I still want to kill them for the strength. Because I need to make a bed. And to make a bed, I need string. Now, of course, I will make a mob grinder, but... I just don't feel like waiting. Um, now let's consume some more flesh. Just regen just a bit here. And of course I have much, much less health than I started out with because I did get some damage. And the rotten flesh doesn't regenerate much because of the hunger effect, which it just starts to um deteriorate my hunger anyway, so. Alright, let me just kill the spider over here. Alright, we got some more um string but not enough string to um not enough string to make another wool and everybody knows that we need three wool for a bed but right now i only have one wool so unfortunately that's not going to work out really really well because i think i will have to wait yeah so anyway now that it's morning time and that was a pretty rough day if you ask me i mean a pretty rough night so now I can get started on my mob grinder building. Alright guys, so now I'm just thinking of a space where to put my mob grinder. Let me just destroy this thing right here because I just don't like it being here. And did I take my crafting table? No. And I'm so, so stupid because I should have remembered to take my crafting table. Let me just go and get that out of the way. Let's get this right here. Let me just break that off right here. Grab my crafting table right here. And um, it is like... It, it's becoming 
um, night time pretty soon because like it's almost midday and uh, like we all know daytime in Minecraft does not last very long it's actually a pretty short amount of time and what is that hole doing right over here let me just patch that up real quick and let me think so over right here is gonna be my base so um my mob grinder is going to be very close to my base so I can easily easily collect it and right here is going to be my base right over here um, no right here is going to be my base like that's my where my house is going to be right here is my crafting table right here and right here is where my mob grinder will be so let me see um, that is one um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually, what is going to be easier is I'm going to count out 24 right here, 24 right over here, and that has a point because I'm going to, like this, this, I'm going to put this here, this here, this here, this here. And that's how I'm going to count, because I don't want to count. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to, I'm too lazy to count. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to switch from this to this. But I have to make sure that the values are always equal. So that, so that I get up 24 blocks up exactly. Let me see. So that's 9, 9, like that. That like that like that like like that that like that like that put that right here put that right here put that right here put put that one right here put that one right here put that one and the final one right here and right over here but now the problem is getting down so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna mine down this column right here and yet inefficient this is almost the only thing I have to do because the otherwise we would have to make ladders and everybody knows that ladders take a ton of wood so I know this might be unpleasing to some people with OCD but what I did is what I'm gonna do is I'm going to now just the, the stone that I just mined I'm going to go like this so finish it up right here and oh yes guys I forgot to mention our draw our mob grinder will be a dry design meaning that it's going to be and I just forgot something I just reminded myself we need the crafting table because in case we need more um, more pickaxes or anything like that and also I was thinking that um, let me just mix actually I need some more pickaxes right now let me just make Two because we don't really need much. Since we're not mining anything, this is just in case we make a mistake. So let me pick that up real quick once again. I'm gonna have to have some sandstone in this right here just so I could climb up right here and then just mine that all down like that. Nobody cares about sandstone. And one thing that I forgot is was stupid is that I turned all of my wood into um sticks so I won't be able to make trapdoors and since this is going to be a dry design we do not yet have water in this world what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to make this design a dry design like I said and to do that to maximize the effectiveness I should put trapdoors around the edges so the mobs are tricked into going down into the stream um, but if I put the trapdoors, I noticed that if we put the trapdoors like near the opening of the funnel, and by funnel I mean this is the funnel, what's going to happen is it's actually going to cause the, the mobs to like, what did I just do? Yep, I, I am going to have to get down here because I keep on forgetting I have to do it all symmetrically. And oh my god, I just hope that we get this block. Oh, yep, we got it, we got it. I really hope we have enough cobblestone to do this because I really don't feel like going back down. We're going to do this all at one time, all in one swing. Now it looks like we have got to the top of the tube, the drop tube right over here. So 
Let's just cap it off right here. That does look like 24 blocks. So let me see. Let me just expand that over here. And oh my god, I just forgot that when I expand, when I make the mob grinder, it's going to make it really, really dark underneath. So unfortunately, mobs might spawn, which will completely suck. So let's see. One. Let me just count out seven. Like right here. So just put it down like this. This. I'm just holding down shift click so hard right now. If we fall down, that's going to be so bad. I love building these mob grinders. They're, they're really nice to build. They're pretty easy to build. Yield a very high amount of um, drops. They're very interesting to build too. It's fun building things in Minecraft. So, so let me see. Yep, we got this part set up. So I, I just got an idea, guys. So, um, like since the the reason that this is eight blocks is because there's supposed to be water flowing down here but since we're not gonna have water flowing down here i was thinking guys maybe we could actually expand it further out there but on the other hand we might not have enough cobblestone let's see one two three four five six seven and eight uh, yeah, we might not have enough cobblestone for that because I did do some calculations on the amount of cobblestone this grinder is supposed to take. And actually, I think that we might run out of cobblestone. One, two, three, four, five, six, se seven, and eight. So yeah, I think we might run out of cobblestone in the building process if we build this ever more than eight blocks. And it looks like the sun is setting, which means mobs will spawn, which is really bad for us because we don't want mobs spawning up here. But hopefully we can spend the night up here, and I don't think it's going to be bad for us. So let me see, let me just, um, I'm just going to, um, place a sandstone right here. This is just going to be a... A plane to build this on, so then I can just destroy this block right here. Then I'm just gonna build all of the walls around here. It's super, super easy. I just love building this grinder. I hope we can get um iron from this build, so we can get maybe iron swords or maybe even like iron. Um, I, I just I almost just said iron golems, but no, no, we're gonna get we're gonna get like iron armor maybe from this. So then we when we go to the Nether can possibly have an iron a pair of iron armor for us but that's only i'm gonna have to like afk here well not afk i'm gonna have to um put like a block a little up so the mobs are one hit kill and i'm just gonna have to stand here and just for a very very long time hitting zombies for us to get iron but one of the first things i'm gonna make if i get iron is i think i'm gonna make shears because we need to collect oh oh that was that was so scary that was just so scary so i think we might need to have leaves here so to collect leaves i think i'm gonna get shears and to get shears we need to get shears we need uh we're gonna need to get shears we're gonna need um i think it's i think it's um yeah, I think we're going to need, yes, we're going to need two iron. Yeah, so it's not too bad. Two iron is fairly easy to make. We're just put this as a reference block because we're going to break it. So, let me see. Let me just put a sandstone here. Let me just fill all this in. And there's already a ton of mobs spawning. And I think I just messed up on one part of the grinder. Is that I shouldn't have have built it so close to my base. Because as you can see down right over there there's going to be our sapling and what's going to happen is the the huge grinder will block out sunlight so what's going to happen is we will have to have we will have to move the um the sapling somewhere else to grow because it won't grow even during daylight when the like when the sun's out the grinder is going to be blocking out all of the sun from it's gonna be blocking out all the sun from reaching the sun. I think it, I think it might still grow, but grow slower. But just in case, I'm gonna move it out somewhere in a different area, just in case it doesn't affect the spawn. Um, 
the the spawn rates of the trees, the grow rates or whatever. Yep. Just jump it over here. And oh my god, guys, I'm in hard and there's barely any mobs spawning. I don't know what this is, guys. Um, uh, in other versions of Minecraft, as I, I was testing this, when I was testing this grind, I think in 1.5.2, there were way more mobs spawning in, in, um, up on here, and definitely is interesting. Let's, let me see. So, it's pretty boring, actually, to build the grinder, and it's probably boring for you to watch, if anyone's watching right now, which probably, I don't know, five people or so, please comment down in the description. Because I really hope someone's watching my videos, and I almost just failed over there. Let me just run and jump. So, I was thinking, guys, this is a very interesting map. is because this is a very interesting, like, survival world, because what's going to happen is that we're going to have... Oh, I, ju I, ju I just saw them spawn, yeah. More are spawning, more are definitely spawning. Maybe I just have to wait for them to spawn. So, anyway... Um, this is going to be a very interesting survival world because what's going to happen is there's going to be strongholds in here and to get water and lava because I, I think I think everybody in here knows that uh, watching right now that um, lava actually lava and water actually spawn inside lava and water actually spawn inside the strongholds like there's water there's a f uh, in the central stronghold room there's like a fountain i think with um i think it has like a block or so of i don't know or two blocks of water but it definitely has lava so what's going to happen is we're going to be able to make a cobblestone generator when we find a stronghold and i think everybody in here knows how to find strongholds we just have to get eye of ender in order to um in order to get some let me just fill in this row right here. In, in order to find a stronghold, where they're going to be using X-ray glitches, or we're going to be getting, or we're going to be getting like Eye of Ender. But to get that, we're going to have to go to the Nether. It's definitely going to be fun. I do plan on going to the Nether in this map. Let's see. So right now, I will just place a sandstone block right here. Let me just see this. I'm just going to stand like. Like right over here. Let me just build this right here. We don't need that block. I'm gonna omit all of the blocks, like all of the blocks that I don't need. I'm actually going to omit. Let me just break that right here. I don't really need that block. So I don't need that block like in the middle there. So I'm gonna omit that block. I'm not gonna place it there because my goal is to save as much solid blocks as possible. And now I am really getting worried about the status of our cobblestone because it is ending soon and we might not even have enough cobblestone, which is going to be the worst part because, I mean, we were like making such good improvements here. Let me see, let me just place that sandstone right here. Let me just mod that sandstone out right there. Because we're making such large improvements, like we're we're almost done with the um, mob grinder, but what's gonna suck is that when we're like almost almost done with the mob grinder, but then we're not gonna have enough stone left. So I think this is pretty boring, guys. So when I finish the mob grinder, I'm going to um like continue filming. And darn, look at all those Endermen spawning down there or I probably shouldn't look because we all know what happens if you aggravate an enderman and why did I just throw out a stone I'm just so stupid anyway oh we have more sandstone left that's great we can probably use sandstone if we're not finished but then it's gonna look horrible so anyway see you all guys later when I'm finished with a mob grinder I'll just start filming then all right guys I'm all finished with the walls here and now I think the episode's getting way too long so this is going to be the end of the episode at the in the next episode I'll be finishing up the mob grinder and testing it and getting all of those amazing drops needed to get our world going. So this was mine Kralix. Thank you for watching. Thank you so so much for watching. Probably no one watching right now, probably like five people or so watching, but um thank you anyway for watching. This is mine Kralix and I'm out. See you all in the next video.